looking at idioms from this lovely book um, I'm on the letter D. If things are a bit head over heels, if they're a bit topsy-turvy, then in Welsh you would say that they are dibbin dobbin, which is very cute. And this one, this is where Welsh does this so brilliantly. So if it's really, really cold, you say it's digon oir i ferry o feiriad mewn cot ffwr, which means it's cold enough to freeze a priest in a fur coat. Digon oir I ferry or ferry had mewn cot for. If somebody uh, is a bit tough or a bit dopey, in Welsh you would say that they're not a full yard. So there is dim and clown chathen. I like that one. Something's got a bit out of hand. They say it's dross ben chestry. Now, I think that means over the top of the crockery. Am I making that up? You help me out, please. So in English, I know that we say that somebody who... Uh, is a bit clumsy, has got two left feet. But in Welsh, if somebody's a bit awkward, you say that they've got two left hands. So that is doi lau chwith. And finally, instead of telling your grandmother to suck eggs, which is something we say in English, which is fair play, this pretty weird. In Welsh, you say dusky pader i berson. And that's telling a priest how to pray, which makes a little bit more sense i think and also as a sort of expression of exasperation in welsh you'd say might say devil so you would say jowl oh god do do yeah devil or god you take your pick